lovely warm day, but on Saturday in the San Luis Valley, the freeze was in full effect. Take a look at this photo. You can see an ice climber making his way up a frozen waterfall. Again, this was on Saturday at Zapata Falls near Alamosa. Now to get there, you have to go down a bumpy gravel road and then hike about a mile. And if you're interested, you can find more photos like this one in the Our Colorado Through Your Photos group, and you'll find that on Facebook. Mike Nelson's tracking the warm up tonight for us. Hi, Mike. Hey, Ann. You know, last Monday we started at 16 below zero, and today we hit 60 degrees above zero. Great contrast. Tonight's going to be mostly clear, kind of a windy evening, 37 by the time we get to 11 p.m. Check that number out, 60 for the high today. 22 is our low this morning. Uh, still not a record, that's 72 degrees for the record high, but 48 is the average, and uh, that 60 felt pretty nice. 57 right now downtown at our studios, 56 out at DI, pressure falling slightly, winds are out of the west at 12 miles per hour. Weather headlines, tomorrow's going to be another windy and warm dry day, but then snow and colder weather comes in Wednesday and the slick roads are going to be Thursday morning from this front that'll come in here later on this week. For right now, it's mild and windy and ahead of it, we're going to just have that hold for tonight with a few high clouds out there, gusty winds, mainly mountains and foothills, and not all that cold. 30 for a low tonight in Denver, 26 at Greeley. Even in the mountain valleys, it'll stay above zero tonight. Gunnison, Alamosa, along the front range in the foothills and mountains, it'll be 20s to low 30s. Some of our western and southern suburbs may not even drop below freezing tonight. So Tomorrow morning, high clouds, some gusty winds, but a pretty mild morning. It's going to be a warm and windy Tuesday. Here comes that front coming in late in the day, turning colder as we get into Wednesday. But at least for tomorrow, we'll still see highs in the 50s, even mid-60s over eastern Colorado. 30s and 40s expect in the mountains. Front range numbers 58 downtown, Broomfield, DIA. We'll see 40s and mid-30s up at the ski areas. So for tonight, it's partly cloudy, occasionally gusty winds, 30 for a low tomorrow. Some high clouds around, but a nice day. Windy, warm, 58 degrees. All right, there's that front late tomorrow. It pushes on through the state as we get into Wednesday. The clouds increase. The snow develops by Wednesday evening. The main snow comes in Wednesday night through early Thursday morning and not a bad little snowmaker. We're talking about two to four for the metro area, four to eight up in the mountains Wednesday night and early on Thursday. So your seven day 58 action days coming up late Wednesday, early Thursday for the snow. Slick Thursday morning, partly cloudy by Friday back to 48. Another chance of some light snow and colder next Sunday with a high of 32. But for now, enjoy the mild weather again tomorrow.